wrestling? I think we need to invent a new punctuation mark for, for that. Wrestling! It's like a... like the Prince symbol. Yeah! Um, my dumb ass forgot to write down what happened uh, at the last event. Uh, I'll see if I can remember it. Um, Dan Severn beat The Rock. Yep. I believe that was the end of their feud. Um, Jericho beat Edge, but we're finishing their feud on the show. We forgot to have Christian and Kane finish their feud, so that's Because also, they were in the King of the Ring right, tournament. That's also happening on the show. Um, the Hardys beat... Uh, Jushin Liger and El Samurai. Um, I don't believe they ended their feud. I don't believe we did. No. Um, the King of the Ring went down, and we had Kurt Angle win. Yes. Uh, Funaki retained his title against China, and their feud's over. Um, and China will be moving on to focus on keeping DX together. Yeah, uh, yeah, that's the other thing that's going on right now is the, is the DX versus GOG. And GOG won their match at the pay-per-view, uh, which in universe probably netted them some sort of benefit um, to the feud. But ultimately, the plan is to have DX win the feud. Yes. So we did all the management stuff beforehand. Um, yep. On the let's end of go the to the episode. book. Uh, so our, our current feuds are still end of the line Golden Age Grotesque versus uh, DX uh, Home Records Inc. versus Air Knees which is ending this cycle unless we somehow get more staleness um, Jericho and Edge which is ending night and uh, the very important feud which can go for another month yeah and Hurt My Ego is also ending could go another month yeah, look at that actually if we kept to if we can get Hurt My Ego over it can go another month Let's, um, I'd say we risk it until we run out of staleness on that, but on promos. Shit that gives us red arrows. Highest red arrows wins. Just do promo battle, yeah. Alright, uh, so now let's go ahead and end uh, Edge versus Chris Jericho. That has enough room to go another month if you wanted. I, I think but Edge losing twice in a row, unless we give him the title back. Yeah, no, I don't we would we would be able to at that point I think uh, maybe uh, mutual respect maybe yeah mutual respect to find blow sure. off there you go um okay so good uh, let's keep a promo here yeah because um, we're, we're basically fishing for more staleness so biggest I wish red there arrows. was more stuff with big red arrows man I wish this was YouTube. <laughs> they do a feud package, but that's a producer thing. Yeah, that, that's not the boys getting their themselves over. That's the producer. Yeah, that's run a promo, Ronald. We just need those red arrows so much. Um. Okay, let's book some matches. Uh. So we blew off. Uh, Funaki's feud, so we need a new feud for a new contender for Funaki's title. We do. And he's had it for like four months now, so it's good to pick someone who could take it from him. And I want to pick somebody lower card so that Funaki can move on to IC stuff, etc, etc. Um, and this is all about building these lower mid-carders anyway. So, what do you think, like a Fatal 4-Way? Uh, Fatal 4-Way to decide, and we shouldn't pick anybody who has a one star in something. I agree. We so, can, those are talents we need to build, not talents we need to push. Um, as the winner. Right? Yeah, oh, as the winner. Oh, wait, 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 wait. That is good. That is good. And we have a, we, but we also have a uh, habit of buying new people and then pushing them. <laughs> we do. We just, to the moon kind of thing. Um, we could probably build her organically somehow. I, I, I'm not against it. These guys have had lots of opportunities and haven't managed to get over is the thing. <laughs> okay. Well, we might be able to do this. I'd say Canyon, Lita, Phineas I. Godwin, who's only not over by coincidence. He's got no negative stats. Oh, no, he's one. Okay. Yeah, he's got a one work rate. Um, the other ones we want are probably John Tenta and um, Bradshaw. If, as long as he doesn't win, yeah. Yeah, well, I think the winner here is either going to be Canyon or... Tenta, Canyon, or Lita. Yep, okay. Done. Um, cool. Funaki's just not on the show. If we have room for a promo for him, we could do that. But, but we'll see if we have one. Um, okay, let's book some Golden Age of Grotesque. In fact, 
Oh, that would be a great promo, but I don't know if we... Explain. Use words. Well, because we could use Vader that way. You got it. If we did a promo. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I, like, I'm sorry. Was there a specific promo you had in no, mind? Was no, what I was just, looking for. Just Golden Age versus DX. Do it. Hey, I suppose. Um, we can have a mostly promo show with no real negative. True, effects. that's very true. Uh, we don't really need the lightning. Let's get some popularity up. Yeah. Um, and we just put on a fucking barn burner, so. Of, is, of a pay per view. Blow offs. That guy. Unlikely partners. That doesn't make any fucking sense. Backstage attack. That's yeah, that's perfect. perfect. And that's how Vader shows up. He conks someone on the head of the lead pipe. Yeah. He's even though he's like got his belt herniation thing on or whatever. Run somebody over with a car. <laughs> I did it. Beep, for beep. The, <laughs> <laughs> the Vader mobile. Mm. Uh, <laughs> okay. Uh, back to matches. Pretty much period. Um, so... I think. You think? Kurt Angle versus The Rock. Two faces. And that's fine. It's it's heel versus heel that the game gets titchy about. Game um, likes face versus heel better. Yes, but it's a storytelling thing. We can't put Dan Severn and Kurt Angle just off the bat fighting. No, well, they've, we've got we a got, very got months before that happens. We've got a very promo heavy show. So I think that Kurt Angle comes out and he's like, I'm so happy to have won King of the Ring. I can't wait to face Dan Severn in an honest match with good intentions. And you expect for Dan Severn's music to start, but no, it's The Rock's. And The Rock's like, I could have done it. I was so close. And he thinks it's, it's still my shot. And so he, Kurt needs to prove himself over The Rock. Okay, sure. I mean, also, it's Kurt Angle versus The Rock. Great job. It'll also build Kurt Angle more because he's still only on the upper mid curve. I mean, if the plan is to have him be uh, fucking... No, not for the King of the Ring. Uh, I mean, you could do that. Yeah, we could, but we're not gonna. Okay. You could easily give, like, you know, I challenge, uh, you know, it's my shot, I deserve that shot. I, Rock wants you one-on-one, -on -one. you go one-on-one -on -one with the great one, and if I win, I get your shot. That's brilliant, actually, now that you mention it. And um, then Kurt Angle wins. Yeah, Kurt Angle still wins, but it's very Kurt Angle to go, okay, I agree to these terms. You know what? I did just get here, I still need to prove, I still need to prove myself, I, you're an established guy, let's do it. And then he just beats him. <laughs> okay, sounds good. If um, we're gonna do face Dan Severn, let's do face Dan Severn. Yeah. Uh, Kane versus Christian. Oh no, we're keeping that going. Yeah. Jericho, as we got that on. We're, there. we're, we're basically fishing for more staleness. Alright, we need a new tag team feud. Did we even blow that off? I don't think. Oh no, we don't. Yeah, it's right there. Never mind. Um, we need a new. Um, I see feud. I see feud. Yeah. Uh, so who's Chris Jericho fight? Who's a good face for Chris Jericho well, to punch? I, I think we might have to blow it off before we start a new feud. Yeah, we haven't blown it off yet. So, um, well, I did mention I would love to see uh, but Eddie's a heel. Jericho. Uh, who is a good face for Jericho to punch? The Patriot. Patriot, that's true. Patriot Canadian. Jericho would be good. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, you as a as a right thinking American, you, you I'm Canadian. <laughs> I'm from Winnipeg, you idiot. <laughs> <sighs> okay. Uh. Well, heck. Let's just put some matches on the card. Yeah, I guess let's just put some matches on the card. Let's get a big match in there. Um. Do we have the Aranies and uh? No. Do you want to have them fight? Not really. No, not really. So let's let's add two more matches and then a final promo. Okay. Promo um, heavy show, but we just had a barn. That's first. fine. Stone Cold, he's good. We love him. Um, Owen Hart. Sure. Throw a heel in there for the bonus. Yeah. Uh oh, Kane. Oh, they want Stone Cold versus Kane. We could, do, we could do Stone Cold versus Kane. Yeah, soon. Not yet, but soon. Um, Owen Hart. Uh, Shamrock's still not over. What's the deal, my guy? This percentage is low, that's all. Okay. Eddie. Eddie! Eddie. Um, and then another good match that people will like. Uh, 
What about... Oh gosh, we still don't have the Patriot doing anything. Patriot could fight Ken Shamrock, right? How's his, his morale to the roof? Let's just do that. Try to build that Ken Shamrock guy up. And then you said one more promo, right? Yeah, for the uh, Aranese versus Harmac yeah. Zinc. Because it's, it's fried gold. So what, what are we building up with this? It's currently um, almost 300, so oh, whatever you want. There was a bodybuilding one. We forgot to do car destruction last time, so let's make a point to do it. Yeah! Time. Do it now! Fuck it! Okay. Alright, let me rearrange some stuff then. Um... Get down there. You get up there then. That's fine. Okay. Promo heavy show, but we just did a barn burner for paper. Yeah, so. it's not too bad. Okay. Play the event. That's still going on. Kane got his over in his back. Yay. I knew that was going to happen. Yeah. He was just on the edge of it. Okay, so. Of this, who do we want? Because this is currently just a match for nothing. So it's just for our entertainment that we're picking a winner. All right. His gimmick is still set to Mortis, but he looks like Canyon. We'll have to fix that at some point. Um... Probably before he did use oops. Uh, oh well. Lita's got the highest overness. Then Lita. Yeah. Who's got the best popularity though? Bradshaw. Oh, who's a heel is a bigger question. Bradshaw. We only put Bradshaw in this yeah, match on the, the contingent star. that he doesn't win. Well, Canyon's neutral. That works. He is injury prone, but. Uh, We've got other people to pivot to in case it happens, so okay. let's go Canyon. Oh, I know he's here. But we didn't tell them it was for any reason. That's true. Hey, big promo. That's good. You like that. Uh, backstage attack. Golden DX. Age Protest is doing the attack, right? No. D no. DX is doing the attack. Golden Age won the pay-per-view. All right, that's true. And then the, 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 theory, the thing we're going with is that the DX, they have more numbers. Right, right, it's the right. numbers game. They all smoosh up on the Golden Age. Okay. The idea I think you were originally going with was Five Vader. Was Vader bonk somebody over the head? But we're ultimately building towards DX winning. Yeah. And uh, Mark this got Mark. Over. This got Mark over somehow. Yeah. X Pac is over. You know, over more. Honestly, thing. you know what this? You know what this probably was? This was probably a big like brawl across the whole arena, and DX eventually like got the advantage because they got more people. Because that's the, that's the narrative we're going. With. Yep. I think originally the intent was to have Golden Age win. But... Bigger number, better stable. Uh... <laughs> Come on, Shamrock, I believe in you. Maybe we should stop trying to get Shamrock over. It's just, it look, it's... Poor guy. Alright, and this happened. Mutual respect, few blow-off. Scroll down, I want to see how the um, blow-off... Yeah, people nice. love that feud. it was a good feud. Cool. Mutual respect, got some experience. Um, got Stone Cold, Morales a little low, Owen Hart, and Eddie Guerrero. Um, this is just a match to exist, so. Yeah. Let's reestablish Stone Cold as our big dude. Okay. Because his morale's a little low. He hasn't done much in a while. Sure. Stone Cold. Hey, it's a good match. It's a good match. For a second, I thought that that somehow got Mark Marrow over. I was very confused. Uh. Car destruction, Homewreckers Inc. destroy they cars. They destroy cars. That's yeah. their bit. Jesus Christ. They just keep buying cars to destroy. And it keeps being worth it. keeps being amazingly worth it. Okay. Great. Um, Kurt Angle versus The Rock. Kurt Angle proves himself, keeps his King of the Ring thing. Yep. Bang. Boom. Eh, it was okay. Scroll up. I want to see how much overness Kurt got for beating The Rock. 21. Yeah. That's He's getting good. up there. This is basically what we gotta do is we gotta beat main eventers. Yeah. All right. Shit. That's how we make face Dan Severn. He, Kurt Angle does the John Cena open challenge with the King of the Ring title shot and just keeps winning. Oh, Project Wrestling put on a hell of a show. Nice. Good for them. Yeah. They still managed to gain .7k less fans than we did with this relatively okay one. I like having uh, competition. 
Uh, me too, but like, they don't, they're, they're not gonna make it, dude. No. Um, okay. So, need to cook up some feuds. Um, let's do a tag team match between, uh, Chris Cannon. Okay. Alright, actually, here's one thing, I'm gonna put it in the book. Um. In things to do? Alright. Yeah. We poached Lena, so I'll go ahead and get rid of that. Uh, Canyon loses big feud in a few months. Goes fully heel, repackage as Mortis. That way, he's debuted to the roster. It's kind of like uh, what they did with uh, Piper Niven recently in WWE, except we haven't named him something stupid like Dewdrop. I like it. <laughs> So Chris Canyon uh, and a tag team partner. Um, I mean Lita. Lita, yeah, it's kind of what I was thinking too. Um, against Shokunaki, and man, he's been doing some feuding. Yeah, he's uh, fought everyone in the mid card. <laughs> Someone else down there a bit. Funaki's full face, right? Yeah. yeah. Maybe um, maybe Funaki and Lita. Yeah! yeah. Alright. So, Funaki and Lita versus Chris Canyon and... Um, is there a member of the Brood who's not busy? With the Brood? They're neutral. Oh. Yeah, I was thinking maybe Test. He's, he's alright. Yeah, okay, Test. Yeah, he wasn't in the match, right? No. No, so it get, gets him in the card. Nobody's booked. Chris Canyon, and how do you... There. Okay. I don't know what happened there, but whatever. There. Let's just move. Okay? Book a different match and then come back to this. <laughs> Alright, that's fine. Uh, let's go to our segments. Um, <laughs> a Homewreckers Inc. vs. Aaron needs to be a segment. Um, let's get something else that needs leveled up. Uh, already held, already held, already held. Could run a feud package. The the producer would get boosts, but like, yeah. What makes these guys over is how good they are. So it well, and that's kind of what I'm thinking is they're over enough that it's not like it hurt that much. Yeah, fuck it, do it. Okay. Give, the, um, give them a week off. Yeah. Give Carl something to do. Um, we did a promo with them last week, so we can do some matches this week. Um, we did a promo with them last week. We could do another one. We definitely need to do Kane and Christian as a promo. Yeah. Uh, let's try to get Christian some more... Overness? Yeah. Yeah, Overness. Kane's um, eventually winning this feud, is the thing. Yes. Because he's taken a lot of losses. He this, has so. been. Um, and it hurt his ego, as we recall. Yeah. So, we need to set up Fuse. That's part of the situation as well. Uh, that's why we were doing Canyon and Test against this is a singles match. Canyon Test against Funaki and Fantastic. You. Oh, because it's a tag. It's not going to do that. We'd have to set it up separately. Yeah, what few do you try to add? Uh, Canyon and Funaki. Okay, then yeah, you'll have to set that up. Yeah, that's fine. Um, once again, I will delete and recompose this match. <laughs> Game's trying to send us a message. Uh, I forgot how to fuse it. Add superstars. Canyon. Stepping up, you think? I mean, sure, why not? It's a good, functional, high heat pew. We'll, we'll grind it a little bit. Okay, hopefully for the last time here. You really attached to this match? <laughs> I'm just trying to get it on the card, you know what I mean? I think it's better to have that be a tag match instead of just a straight up one on one. Okay. 
Um, plus it showcases two talents. We don't get the chance to showcase a lot. Okay. Uh, so we need to do a feud as well. Were we thinking Eddie Guerrero versus Ed? Or uh, Chris Jericho? No. This is heel. Uh, Patriot versus Jericho we talked about. How long has Jericho been champ? A couple months? Two? I Jericho's think? been the champion for two months. Yes. So someone to lose. Someone to, to lose to Jericho and then maybe win next month. If they can put on a two month game. There was someone you said you'd rather have take the IC title than lose. It was him, Eddie. But he's a heel. Yeah. So... We could transition to someone pretty easily. Honestly, Mark Marrow just got hot. That might be a decent boost. Mark's busy. Oh, that's right. Um, and that's why we're doing this. Yes! Okay, well, let's book something else for a second. Uh, we did hurt my ego. We did... Get the home records promo on there. Yeah, it's on there. Oh yeah, it's pretty good. Um, it's the feud package we're doing. This. <laughs> Let's get a match on there. Yeah, let, let us get a match. Uh, is this really... We, we got everything blown out? Well, let's do the Kurt Angle thing, though. How's that sound? Let's set up Kurt's next defense. Um, of his... Just have him, have him beat some main event. Yeah. A heel, I think, would be best. Because he beat a face last week. Right. Who would be mad who could afford to lose? Sean. HBK, yeah. yeah. That's <laughs> and then that's the main event, and Kurt Angle wins. Um. Uh, you know what? Dan needs some shit to do. Until Kurt. Who's Dan fighting? Yeah, if this is what we're going to do... Uh, the whole way through. Um, well, we got several months until SummerSlam. Two, I believe. Yeah. Unless, since it's two months, unless you wanted to build up Tan versus Kurt for two months. No, I think this is good. We'll, we'll put... I mean, we could just have Dan be popular. Like... It feels like a waste to not have our champion in a few, is all. Sure. But otherwise, it would be either killing a feud that's probably going to get hot immediately after a month. Or having Kurt Angle lose twice. Or having him do the thing where they, where he goes, where it ends in a, like a mutual respect thing. Like we did with Edge just now. Okay, here's another idea. What if we put Dan in the feud? Mm -hmm. I mean, mechanically, we will recognize this, the people won't. We put Dan in a feud with somebody he's going to be feuding with for a while. Kurt Angle is a bump in the road. This tour is to build Kurt Angle. Kurt Angle is king of the ring. He's not winning that match. Dan and Kurt Angle don't necessarily need to keep fighting after SummerSlam. No, but it's a great way to build Kurt. Yes. So yeah, if we, we establish a new long-term feud for Dan, and then Kurt Angle is a is a bump in the road. Maybe even make Kurt's and Kurt Angle shot a triple threat. So that Kurt can get mad he never got a singles shot. Sure, that would be great. Um, let me click on Dan and see who... I kind of figured that was going to happen. Um, but he's busy. <laughs> he is busy. What about Owen? Owen's hot. That's a good long-term feud. Yeah. He hasn't fought with him yet. Yeah, I think so. Not for uh, the title. Uh, let's actually put that. Okay. And then make a feud out of him. This is a new thing, and it's going to be long-term, so I want to I want to have something that's got inherent... Oh, duh. Greatest wrestling. Okay. It's yeah, Owen's yeah. signature feud. I think that's what he and Dan and The Rock were fighting over, too. So. It's basically just the feud we always do with Dan. Yeah, because he's... Because he is! He's the greatest wrestler! <sighs> Unrecognized. In his own prime. Um... We don't have a Hardys versus uh, Jushin Liger and Samurai. Um, Hardys won uh, at the pay-per-view. Yeah. Um, there's no if we're gonna if we're gonna do this for another month, we can either do a promo because we're about even right now, or we could have them just have another fight. 
I think promo's probably better to fish for more staleness. Yeah, I think so too. Just get that lightning up, huh? Yep. Very important feud, this is. Oh, that's why I put that down the card, because it's a feud package. Yeah. Uh, okay. Now another match. Yes, we need to figure out that icy tile situation. Yeah, and this can be a good match. Yeah. I tell you what, uh, we have eh, we have Jericho in a triple threat with two other guys. One of them wins. Back to the new contender. Not for the title. Okay. Um, here's another idea. Mm -hmm. What if we broke up El Samurai and Jushin Liger? I feel like we could use them both better outside of the tag team. They're in the middle of a feud right now. Once they're done, yeah. That's what I meant, yeah. Maybe the you know, Hardy Boys trounce them again and they're like, I don't think this is working out. I like that idea. It was fun to I like that, come into the bed like, with you. I like yeah. that idea. <clears throat> um, so Chris Jericho, uh, I don't want Ken to win. But, but Ken can be in that He's fine filler here. And then the obvious actual contender. Um, we could do Patriot. It's a good. It's a good feud. We could. We could do Stone Cold. Is that does that feel like a step down for Stone Cold? I don't feel like it does. I feel like the IC title's been really built up. I mean, the IC title is basically our other main event title. Try as we might to make it different. The inherent mechanics of this game cause gold to roll uphill. It does. Yes. If you're putting on a good show. So, I'd say, yeah, fuck it. Sure, why not? There's no shame in being IC champ, man. It's one of my favorite belts. Well, it used to be back in the day. Uh, not for the title. We'll move title. Uh, and then, well, I think we have to manufacture the feud because of the three-way. Oh, uh, we probably do. Yeah. So. Oh, I forgot to do that beforehand, so... But we still needed to pick, so... Yeah. Um... Uh, and Chris Jericho. I mean, it only costs five. It adds up, but it's not like it's a big deal. If we can do it in the thing for free, it's better. If we can't, that's fine too. Not two greatest wrestler ones. No, I want I want something. Uh, these these this, these guys are inherently hype, so we don't need something super big. But greatest wrestler, better better wrestler, meh. New challenger would work, but he's Stone Cold Steve Austin. Yeah. I feel like. I feel like he's like ideally I would there'd be a feud like title hunting where someone from further up the card just wants gold so they come down the card to go take it from someone they see as beneath them. I don't think Stone Cold would do that. I think Stone Cold would, however, find someone who pisses him off and, and just go show. to ruin their life. Yeah. Um, we will call this feud the Austin effect. <laughs> You know what? You got you're a mealy mouth of some bitch. I'm gonna ruin your life. Uh, and of course, in character, it happens after the match, but that's not how it is. Sure. Uh, Jericho, Stone Cold, and we had uh, Shamrock. And then, not for the title. Not for the title. And then Sham Stone Cold wins that. Move that shit up. All right, so one, two, three matches. One, two, three promos match. We have two spots left, and we're about even. We could, uh, if we do another promo, that'll uh, even things up, and then we pick whatever we want for the last one. So, what's another good promo we could do? Okay, um, we need to do DX versus Golden Age. End of the line. It's uh, not on there. So no, yeah, that's what I was saying. Uh... Another match. Another. Uh, promo? Probably, probably promo, right? We, got, we have space for both. Or we could do two. Yeah, do both, fuck it. Yeah, um, well, actually, we might could, we could do two matches, honestly. Uh, yeah, but that didn't work as well. I'd say let's do a promo. Okay. Let's do at least one promo. Alright, end of the line. Feud promos. Um, this is hot. It could be hotter. Um, let's have them... Backstage attack, or this, the, the, the narrative here is the numbers game, right? Yes. Is that DX has more people. Promo ambush. Perfect. You know, Golden Age Grotesque is out talking about how they'll, they'll you know, they, they know they're behind. They know that, they know that DX has more numbers, but they're the Golden Age Grotesque. They're all champions. They, they you know, they've, they've been at the top of this industry for so long, and then DX just comes in and mobs them again. I like it. 
Um... All right, that being said, um... I'd love to do something with Mark, but he's so bad. Well, he's managed to get on the up to the upper mid card through strength of us loving him alone. Yeah, he sure has. I'm up for whatever. What if we put him in the ring with an amazing wrestler to give him experience to, and to overall raise the rate of the match? Okay, yeah, I mean, he probably shouldn't win. No, I don't think so. Put him against someone in the main event, someone who's four and four. We got a couple of those. Yeah, we do. Um... Yeah, fuck it, Mick Foley. He's a heel. Mark is. Foley's busy though. Yeah, he is. Fuck. Um, is the Rock? The Rock's not. I don't think the Rock's doing anything. Yeah, have the Rock beat up Mark Henry. Fuck. Sure, they got old bad blood. But that. Um, He's the Rock. That's uh, there. You know what? You know what this is. This is backstage. Rock wants to get his friend some TV time. Sure. Yeah. He, so he just lost two matches in a row. Mark Henry just like disrespects the Rock. Like. Comes like shoves him out of the way or like knocks some of his shit over, and the Rock takes exception, so they have a fight. Easy, easy enough. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Mm I just like it when they, they alternate. I've been able to tell. Yes. It just <laughs> makes me happy. Okay. Look, the game doesn't care, so do you live your life. Nice six experience for Carl, which is what we were here for. Got him. It's the least effective thing they've done in months. But it got it over 300. So. All right. So, um, I think this is where Canyon's going to get a win here. It makes him look it, like a strong contender. Yeah, that's the point. He's stepping up. If you just started. Uh, it's not the best thing in the world, but... It's two lower cards. It's not going to yeah. These guys are still that, doing hot That, however, shit. finally got over. Christian's nice. Christian's starting to get over, too. Hot segment. Beautiful. Uh, the Rock is winning this match. Yeah, he's the fucking Rock. Yeah, what? If uh, it worked against the crowd, if they had worked with the crowd, it would have been a beautiful three stars. Oh, well. Poor Mark. Poor Mark. That's all right. We had this promo battle. It's a hot feud now. Good. So that's good. That's what we were, we were fishing for more staleness, so we got it. Um, okay, and Stone Cold's winning this. He's the contender, yeah. yeah. Good match. And this is a good rub for Chris Jericho to be in a feud with Stone Cold Steve Austin. Hell yeah, dude. Uh, end of the line, DX is ambushing them, so they win. Man, it's really great because there's 90 amazing guys in this fucking contest. Uh, Alright, this, this is... is starting. You know what? Dan has lost. His streak's already over. This is non-title. So Owen wins. Yeah, Owen just takes this. What the hell? How crazy. Nice. It's got some good starting. Goo. And Kurt Angle retains against Shawn Michaels. Five fucking stars. That's what you want. He's popular now, baby. Yeah. The gimmick is good. Really this, building the prestige of the Kangaroo. This is a great way to build the prestige of the Kangaroo contract for future years. Yeah, also. that's good too. Cool. All right. And how did that show do? 57. We've done worse with a better card. Uh, you know what the weird thing is? Kurt Angle winning against Dan Severn lost the feud to popularity somehow. Oh, you mean, uh, yeah, Owen Hart? Down Arrow, look. Hmm, weird. Or Owen Hart, it's, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, wow, EPW got fans. Project Wrestling got fans. Maybe we should put on mediocre shows now and then just to give them a chance. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're just gonna give you a week. It's fine. Uh, build the uh, the competition. Okay. Um, did we did car destruction, right? Yeah. We finally did that. We did a car destruction. I, I really want to make sure. You wanted to do the bodybuilding one, and we yes. did car destruction instead. That's right. Because you hate the bodybuilding one. You're so mean to me. <laughs> is, 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 is the name not bodybuilding? Is that? Uh, I, yes, bodybuilding. Perfect, yeah. So let's see, we need more shit like this. It gives even spread, too. Like, these things are silly, but when we have them... I mean, if you have people who are willing to be silly, yeah. it works. There's some guys who certainly aren't. Um, okay. Kane versus Christian needs to be a promo again. 
Uh, did they already fight last week? Is that what Who happened? Who cares? Fight again! All right. Cool. <laughs> um, VIF is doing fine. Maybe they should have a match here. Did they? Yeah, have a they match haven't had a match in a couple weeks. So let's let's resolidify them as as uh, as contenders, contenders who are worth the fucking name. So have them fight not for the title, mm-hmm. but have them beat the Hardy Boys. Yes. Okay. Um, singles matches. Now that we've actually got shit. Uh, Chris Jericho versus Stone Cold Steve Austin. It sounds like a straight up tag team match, my friend. Stone Cold. He is a face, so he's going to be hanging out with Owen, his old buddy. They are like kind of weirdly pals. Yeah, they, they've, they've gotten along a lot in the. The, the Dan dub. Severn versus uh, Jericho. Jericho, yeah. Perfect. Done. Yep, that's exactly it. Um, okay. Uh, what other feuds do we have? Funaki versus Canyon. These need help. Promos are a way to help. Yes. So both of these should probably be promos. If we can fit them on the card as both promos, we're still having a lot of matches. Both what? What are you talking about? The two lower, the two, the two ones that need arrows. The the, the twenty six, the two uh, feuds go to singles feuds. Hurt my uh, no. It is already. Okay, yeah. Then stepping up. Yeah, step stepping up. Yeah, that could use a promo just to get it on its feet. Yeah. Okay. Um, just honestly. There's something inherently There's that's fine. This we don't need to overthink. Okay. And let's do a match. Yeah. Um, let's do uh, some Golden Age versus DX. Yeah. Re- reignite that fight. HBK is not in here. Let's just do a one-on-one match. <laughs> yes. Um, and then uh, let's. I feel like Foley's giving, so he, he doesn't mind losing. HBK can win. Yeah, he just HBK lost can last win. Week. Uh, lower card match. Marrow and Goldust beat. A DX tag team. I like it. Look, this is a big feud. It Having it take a couple spots on our card is not a bad thing. Um, Goldust, Mark Marrow, taking on China's Great. And, D- and X-Pac. X-Pac is also Or Billy Gunn. Great. Billy Gunn's a Billy, little more over. Billy's morale is kind of crap, though, so. And X-Pac is just happy to have a job, so. Uh, Okay, um, we've got one more thing we can do. Uh, we are not currently using... We have space for another promo. If we want to keep Oh, it you're right. We could do a promo. Uh, Is there a feud we haven't covered? I don't think so. No, we got all the feuds on there. Um, then, a uh, promo just to get somebody over. So nobody in the main event. Paul Ellering talk of how cool Mark Henry is again? We could do that. I mean, that just boosts his popularity, right? Yeah, that, that's all it does. So it's not like it's Making him better? Himself. Yeah. Uh, Lita could maybe cut a face promo. Yeah, fuck it. Okay. Uh, we're on single break. Lita. Spirited, Spirited promo. promo. Cool. That's not really balanced the way I like it, but Swap it, it is what it is. Well, that would have this match before Punaki. <laughs> you like it when they alternate, but it's more important to you to have a... That it makes sense, yes. Yeah. Alright, here's Lita. She's cool. Do you guys like her? Yes. You do. You like Lita. Good. She got overness and popularity. And that got some experience. Which is good. Uh, Funaki and Canyon are having a talk. Hey! Yeah, it just... Sometimes you just need to... Have, they need to talk to get the feud on its legs. Um, Alright, end of line. This is the one that Golden Age is winning. Yes. Okay. Mark Marrow, we got a change to happy from content. I that always throws me off, and I'm like, why are you mad? You won. Why? <laughs> it's same. It always throws me off too. Perfect. Ooh, great, great. Hurting the ego. Okay. Uh, this is where these guys get a win to prove yes. that they can still hang. Okay. Good. Very important feud. Very important over. Um, this is 
bodybuilding. This is for who is who is more cut? Who is more built? Who are who are better bodies? One of them has a Godfather in it. <laughs> uh, God, jeez! Every time I think Homewreckers Inc. has done the most over thing they can, they get a few more over. They're too powerful, dude. HB Shizzle gets a whizzle. Yep. There's the plizzle. That's the plizzle. Nice. He's very plizzled with his missile. Stop that. <laughs> um, honestly, I I'm going to say the underdogs win this one. Yeah, okay. Like, quote, unquote, underdogs. One of them is Stone Cold Steve Austin, so I don't really buy that they're the underdogs. But that's, that's like the thing is like, you know, uh, so far... Dan Severn has been unstoppable. And Dan Severn beat the... Beat, Beat Stone Cold Steve Austin from pillar to post. So like, this is this is a good way to establish Owen as like a real actual contender of like he keeps beating Dan. Mentally, it will also allow us to break that fabric for Dan and make him different in views going forward. Yeah, as opposed to just the unstoppable monster. Plus Jericho, you know, getting his ass kicked while the chase. He's is going so on. good yeah. at that. He's good at that exact thing. Maybe Jericho dropped off the apron and ran away and left Dan there on his own or something. Or maybe, like, uh, Owen and Dan began fighting to the back and Stone Cold just mopped Jericho up. Project Wrestling Weekly got a whole 400 fans. Good for them! Good for them. I'm happy for you guys. Yeah. One show to fully loaded, we should probably do... Wow, this one's gone by quick. We're going to do a short episode. Uh, well, maybe not entirely, but it felt quick anyway. Um, let's do a event hype package. Nice, nice. Um, let us. Woof, we're we be fucking toeing the line on that one. And if we just do a promo, it'll be just fine. Yep. Uh, let's just get this as sizzling as we can. Yep. And then the ironies are going. Over, I think. Yeah. Okay. We also need a promo. What's our highest staleness fuel? In between Kane and Christian, promo. Yeah, if uh, and we can fit this in, but that's four of four. So we need to get the most red arrows we can to try and get it more staleness. Or we'll just have to blow it off the paper. Oh yeah, we will blow it off the paper. Oh yeah, even if it gets this is gone way long. So let's just try to get let's keep these boys fighting. Okay. Like let's get Christian that that goo. As much of a boost as we can until we have Kane beat him at the pay-per-view. Um I feel like we've done the good version of an Undertaker versus Maven. <laughs> a little bit, yeah. Um, let's yeah. keep building for this shit here. Yeah, I'd say give him another promo. Give him room. Room to work. Something inherently hype. Give me more red arrows. Yeah, just this is fine. Promo bell is fine. Just, it's not the most exciting thing in the world, but it's fine. It's, you just gotta let these dudes work to try and build themselves up. Four left. Again, we're going to be running a little promo heavy, but I feel like... For the go-home show, it's fine. Yeah. So we, we need uh, the all-important... This is a great opportunity for a straight-up tag team match. We just had a tag team match. Yeah, we did. Um, we did this. Let's pop it. Yeah. Okay. So let's get some matches. So what's your problem with this guy? He, he's a mealy mouth some bitch. Look at him. Now look at him. Take a whole full 60 seconds. I think we'll wait. Yay! Look at him. And then... And Jericho's just mugging like, come on, man. Flexing, like, <laughs> just like cocky. And then Triple H takes a long full 60 seconds. No, I get it. I get it. Yeah, yeah. I get it entirely. <laughs> so you, why are you... Uh, why are I kind of want to kick his ass. <laughs> you, why why you want to get beat up by Stone Cold? <laughs> <laughs> oh Jesus, it's great. Okay. I mean, don't get me wrong. I hate the guy, but he's he's gonna fucking destroy you. Let's be honest. We can do another straight up tag team match if you want, but it, we need different partners than. No, I people. mean you're right. We already did one. Um, we could do the live version of the unlikely partners. Stone Cold and Dan. Uh, well, Dan and Dan Owen versus somebody. Some lower carders, and having just get the rub for being in the match. Uh, versus uh, fucking Mosh and Thrasher. Fuck it. <laughs> We're not doing anything with those guys. Sure. Uh, Owen Hart. And basically what that ends up being 
is who can do the cooler thing while beating up Moss and Thrasher. Yes. Yeah, exactly. Uh, I can be there. Um, so I'm thinking in that sense, we get uh, a bigger three-on-three three as the main event. No HBK. In fact, maybe we'll get Golden Age to win this one because they're losing at the pay-per-view. Yeah. Um, so let's get Mick Foley, Goldust, Mark Marrow. They'll go up against China. Uh, Billy Gunn. Sorry, Billy. I'm so sorry, Billy. I know that you guys' morale's not great, but you'll get it back here. That'll be our main event. And then they face the actual tri DX. Yeah. We got Triple H. Handicap and... match if we can manage that. Yes, if we can manage that. If not, it is what it is. Um... Oh, yeah, there's right there. Duh. Question mark, the question mark. One versus three, two versus three. Oh, cool. All right, cool. Fantastic. Thank you. Um, we've got one thing left. Is this all of our feuds? Hurt my ego, the Austin effect. Stepping up. So, all right. Actually, I don't think Golden Age should win this match. No? No. I think, in-universe, this is a match to determine... You know, we, 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 we're tearing the arena apart. We're, we're fighting over everything. We can't keep ourselves. We, you know, the management has decided that we have to end this. We're gonna have a match at the pay per view, and the loser, ha the loser disbands. This is the match to determine the stipulation. Mm, Golden Age wants a hardcore match. DX wants a handicap match, and then they cheat to win. All right. The only thing we need is uh, the very important few. That can just be a fucking match for all I care. <laughs> Um, it's it's a tag team title match up at the pay per view that the, the those other boys are losing. So I have an idea. Okay, I'm here for it. I'm ready. I'm prepared. Um, three on three. Samurai Liger. Man, we don't have Kurt Angle's match on this card. No, we don't. We could have so him add we, Kurt yeah, Angle to this tag and this. then put Eddie on the other side. <laughs> Sure. Um, versus uh, Matt and Jeff. Matt. Jeff. And actually, it should probably be another member of the group. Oh, no, they, they no, split, we split them up. Yeah. So, yeah, fucking Eddie. He's not up to anything, is he? No, and he's great. Him on the card. There you go. Done. Cool. And then Kurt Angle wins. Oh, fuck you, minus 15 alignment boost. That's fine. Face, 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 neutral, neutral, heel. That's weird. Yeah, fuck it. I don't care. Oh, I, I can't figure out why it would do that. Yeah, so. but whatever. Right? Kurt Angle wins. Yeah. Kurt Angle wins. All right, let's. Oh, wait, does it? It bangers. No, that's not. What tag matches on this card? Yeah. Oh, well. That's all right. It's a go home show. What do yep. you expect? All right, let's do this. Look, if it's a shit show, then our competition has a chance to be competition still. Yeah, okay, that's about what I expected. Yeah, got, got He's getting better at these. Mm -hmm. Okay. Perfect. Yes. Good. Good. This is shit. what you want. Get Christian popular. Wow, I got over 100. Or 200. Still not hot, though. Hey, that was better than I thought. No, it went down by three. I meant the quality. <laughs> This is weird. Dan Severn and Owen just don't seem to have much in the yeah, way of not, not chemistry. You know, we haven't had them do any promos. It's just been all matches. That's true. That's true. Hot segment for them. <coughs> to no one's surprise. Uh, Kurt Angle wins lol. Kurt Angle wins lol. It's a fine match. Yep. Uh, talk show segment should be... Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you put Triple H, Stone Cold Steve Austin, and Chris Jericho in a ring. Oh, they put on a good promo. Oh no, shit. A few hot now too. So. Um. Okay. So you said DX wins here by cheater. By cheater. Should we add a finish to it? Fuck it. Yeah. Why not? Sure. Um. Oh, no cheating. Cost anything. Nice. Uh, we lose half a star, but that's fine. Yeah. Fuck it. Mm, okay. Uh, DX wins by cheater. And that's why they get their. That's why they get their um, d handicap match at the pay-per-view. Right, because they cheated. Oh, Billy Gunn's starting to get over. Thanks, fans. All right. 
46. Right, that was show. a good show. Yeah, not bad. Not bad. Not our best show, but no, we but still gained no, fans. Oh, look, Project Wrestling got some fans. We only we only gained 12 instead of like 50k, which is usual, but still. Well, we've been running kind of a quiet month. Yep. All right, one event effect. What this is the effect? Is... Uh, street fight. Can we do a handicap street fight? Can Golden Age of Grotesque versus DX just end an all-out fucking brawl across the entire arena in universe across the whole night? We could do that. Maybe maybe that's a thing, whether actual or not. A promo at the beginning of the show that says you cheated, but you did win, so you both won. You'll be fighting each other. You get your handicap match, but it's a street fight. Yeah. All right. Tag because team. that gives that gives the Golden Age some Christian hope. Mark. You know? How many motherfuckers are in this stable? Shawn Michaels, Triple H, China, Billy Gunn, Road Dog. Five. Five. Xbox Six. <laughs> a taco Xbox found under a dumpster. Seven. <laughs> but this gives the Golden Age hope because they can equalize with weapons. Shawn Michaels, Triple H, Road Dog, China. Right? That's everyone. No, you gotta three, pick the three four, first. Five, six. Oh, God. It's three versus six, not six versus three. Great. Right, I see. Okay. Uh, well, what if. Can I just. Let's no, see if this works. That did not work. Well, I haven't clicked anything yet. Uh, yeah. Me. Oh, hey, nice. Thanks, guys. Gimmick. gimmick. Street fight. Someone's gonna get it. Oh, absolutely! <laughs> <laughs> this, okay. this is well built. It's not as over as the fucking Aaronese and, and uh, Homewreckers Inc. doing a push-up contest, but this was well built wrestling. Yeah. Um... Dan wins this. Yes. It, it's Dan's exhale. It's uh, okay. I can beat him, but it's a close match. Yeah, very close. Skin in the teeth. Uh, we might put a gimmick effect on that one. Chris, like, cheats to keep his title. Because the, cause the feud's so not... Yeah. On pay-per-view, though, eh. It's not like it's the main event. Yeah, fuck it, yeah. What other reason could you have for Stone Cold Steve Austin at that point in the fucking feud? To not win? To not win, yeah. And Chris just got the title, so yeah, okay. Yeah. Um, okay. Uh, this, let me do this here. I guess just run it. There's no reason for that to end, so just run it, Funaki wins, and then we run it for another month. These guys can do stuff, I yeah. believe in them. Yeah, I believe in them too. Uh, I'd like to do something else with that, but I don't know. Um, I guess it's in the context of the match. Yeah. Maybe Canyon does really well. Maybe Funaki gives him another shot, like, Monday. Not, like, literally a shot, but, like, he comes out and he's like, No, you did good. I think you might let's, be able let's to run, Let's run yeah. it back. Let's run it back. Uh, this is happening. It's ending. Book. Um, yeah, more popular than that. Now, we don't want to make it... Too much of a gimmick match for extravaganza, but that's 357. Do we want to put a gimmick match on that? What are they? What are they climbing a ladder for? Oh, only for a championship. That's right. It is not my old EFID. Uh, undo. Thank you. I guess a pole match. Uh... I just put this in like a steel cage, me. Steel cage? Okay. Um, okay. What was the other thing? This. Very important thing. This can just be a match. Tag team titles. That could easily blow off. But... Yes, that the end of that. Okay. Um. Are you blowing off um, Kane versus Christian? Yeah, did I not? It says add blow. Oh, wow, move I on. did not. My bad. Thank you. And Kane's just winning. Kane's just winning. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so. That's everything. Um, we need the uh, main event hype. Well, 
Yeah. I mean, might as well have it. Yeah. Um, we have to have... Tonk versus... Tonk versus Smaller. This time, let's have the... Um, these guys are both fine with comedy stuff, right? Yeah. Let's have them do something silly. Okay. Um... No. Anger management! But they're not a tag team. Ah, but it would be perfect! It would be. Siblings parody? I mean, it works. I'm sorry, are you having Honky Tonk Man cup Jerry Lawler? Or I was the thinking reverse? the other way around. It is Jerry Lawler after all. Uh, you know what? Fuck it, yeah. Actually, I think after the Steel Cage match, we're gonna need the, the We'll breather need the breather. Yeah. Okay, um... Anything we don't have on here? I think just maybe a, a big singles match down here somewhere uh, with our main event guys. Just to get them on the card? Yeah. Uh, Rock, Patriot, Edge is not doing anything. Kurt Angle is not doing anything. So. Oh! Um, Put a heel in there? Eddie. Have it be for the King of the Ring title shot? Kurt Angle wins. <laughs> sure. <yeah. laughs> We can put that up a little bit. Um, there, right? Sure. What a weird build. Uh, eh, I'd like to have a chance. There. Okay, um, that seems fine to me. Yeah. Okay. Anything else needed blown off? I don't think so. No. Hey, play. All right, let's do it. Yes, play the event. Fully loaded. Everybody's thrilled for fully loaded. Uh, Funaki retains, correct. Kane wins, correct. The Rock wins a contract, no. Uh, titles, no. Uh, Homewreckers Inc. win, no. Uh, Jericho retains, correct. Golden Age of Grotesque win, no. And Dan Severn retains by cheating, extra no. What? Why? He's Dan Severn. He's Dan Severn. He doesn't need to cheat. Good video package. It promoted bullying. I don't know. I wasn't reading that. Uh, oh, we're not Fucking here. God damn it, dude! <laughs> okay, oh. that makes sense. <laughs> Promoted bully. Uh, Kane wins this yeah. with a big squish. Nice. Kane's on the way to becoming a face of the company. That that few did good stuff. And ultimately got Christian over. A bit. Yeah. Kurt Angle wins, lol. Kurt Angle wins, lol. Oh, it's perfect! It's starting to get over. Uh, yes, it's working! And it was a fantastic match. Everybody got over, nobody got hurt. Edge's work rate increased to level three. Yes, this is working! We don't have actual smarks in the audience who can reject Kurt Angle, so it's just working. Hardy Boys win, lol. Uh, very important feud that we started as a joke, I need to remind you, blew off at over four stars. Smart, good, uh, yes. Great. All right, huh? Aaron, are taking this one? Yep. Bam. Fantastic. Uh, prove yourself. They proved themselves in almost a five-star feud. Steel Cage match effect increased for this. The Godfather got work rate. It finally happened! <laughs> wow. Yay! <laughs> uh, Lawler is the, the one who's yeah, doing well, the cooking. Yeah. <laughs> I am the one who is he's, doing he's the, the cooking. He's the cucker. I think is the technical term. <laughs> Uh, Not the cookie. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. The Honky Tonk Man is in the ring when Jerry Lawler appears on the Titan Tron lying in bed. The Honky Tonk Man's spouse appears and joins Jerry Lawler in bed. The video cuts away as the Honky Tonk Man looks on. Shattered. Shatter. <laughs> God, why is this why Vince books these? Oh. They're really funny. <laughs> All right, we're adding a finish to this. Um, cheating. <sighs> cheating is that what we wanted? Yeah. Oh, wow, we can do a ring clap. Oh, respectful. And, well, there's some good stuff here. Uh, anyway, but yeah, uh, uh, cheating. Cheats to win. Uh, That's fine. Jack wins. Jack wins. That would have wow. been a five-star match. Ooh. That would have been a five-star match without the cheating. Nice. This feud's going to be great. Yeah. Good. Cool. Um, And Jericho got a huge rub from that. Yeah, he did. All right, DX wins. Goodbye, Golden Age. You oh were... my god! Melts is. Yes! Over five stars, good lord. Golden Age of Grotesque has disbanded. X Pac is starting to get over. Billy Gunn is over. Mark Merrill's no longer over. Uh, how beautiful. And 
one. Road Dog's work rate increased to level three. Good lord. Marrow's work rate increased to level three. Holy shit. This was a good feud. Wow. Look at all that shit DX got. Street Fight leveled up. Wow. This worked. Yeah, how was that feud? End of the line. Also over four stars. Nice. Five star match. This, like, all right. So what was the story? This is a story. This is a match that's interesting enough that, like, this was, I feel like this was the story of, of like, the Golden Age of Grotesque, like, the Warriors 3 at each other's backs, just fighting everyone off oh, yeah. from every angle. DX is, you know, individually weak, but they have numbers. <laughs> Man, it has to end with that, that whole thing where they, like, they've lost track of DX, except for the one guy they just beat up, maybe HBK. Or, or like, a couple Triple of them H. or whatever, yeah. And they, they, like, look down the hall, and there's the rest of DX with, like, weapons that were, like, foreshadowed throughout the match. Goldust just looks at Mick Foley and Mark Merrow and goes, Gentlemen. They, they like, hold... <laughs> Mark Merrow holds up a chair. Mick Foley holds up a barbed wire two-by-four. <laughs> Goldust holds up, like, the kendo stick he has and, like, samurais it forward. It's been an honor. <laughs> <laughs> oh, beautiful. Perfect. Uh, Dan Seven retains. Yes. Just clean. No chicanery. He doesn't have to. He's Dan fucking Severn. Perfect. And what a, what a glorious end for the Golden Age. Yeah, really great. I think that's... People are going to remember that for the rest of time. Um, good. All right. This was a... It was an okay show. We did all right. Yeah, you know, it could have been better. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it could have. This star ratings actually go up really far, but... The Wrestling Spectator... Oh, my lord. We sold a lot of pay-per-view tickets. <laughs> yeah. Billy Gunn becomes hot. This, fully is, loaded. this is sorted by news that's pertinent to me specifically. <laughs> <laughs> fully loaded had a great match. Jericho and Stone Cold had a good mm -hmm. match. Uh, Homewreckers Inc. and the Ernie's had a good match. Good match. Good match. All-time classic between Edge... And four others. And then, yeah. That's yeah. right there. F friggin' that's... That that better be match of the year candidate, because it's so over. The over five star one? Yeah. How wild. Okay. Also, Undertaker's back! Just as Kane ended his feud. Oh, it's so perfect. Okay. Put that in the book. All We're right. booking <laughs> that. Yeah. Um, <laughs> so that's fine. Okay, we broke up. G.O.G. That's fine. And we okay. trimmed the brood. We did both. We did. Yeah. Um, so, Undertaker versus Kane. It's brilliant. Uh, split up El Samurai and Liger. Yep. Um, oh, we've got a lot of news, too. Let's read the news first. All right. Scroll all the way to the bottom. Let's go from the bottom up. Edge. Godfather, Godfather, Marrow, Road Dog, uh, Undertaker is over and just got a nice boost. Uh, Pantera is still looking good down there, guys. If you want to bring Pantera up, that'd be good. No. Uh, George Steele, he's old. No, thank you. I don't know who Daniel Oliver is. It's a pretty good show, top to bottom, but I think you can do better. Maybe you could even come up to our level. Slide pulled back. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, a little higher on the low end, but a lot lower on the high end. So that's good. Vader's doing better. He's going to get back and be like, Where, where'd my stable go? No, oh, Vader's sad. Uh, Greg Valentine, 47. I don't that's too old, Greggy. I'm sorry. What? Game Charisma over. Charisma, one of three. Bullshit. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. It's part-timer, too. Uh, Hennig, it will be available next call-up. Dragon, uh, dragon, give us this fucking ultimate fucking yeah. Ultimo Dragon. Yes, Ultimo Dragon is here and the Undertaker's back in the same month. Yeah. Um, let's get a reminder for ourselves. Ultimo. Ultimo. Dragon. So, our plans with the feud is for. Owen uh, is Severn Crypto Knight, but Severn ultimately goes over, right? Um. Unless we can somehow stretch it to fucking WrestleMania, yeah? Sure. Oh, wow, God, that'd be forever. Uh, Kurt, and this is SummerSlam. Severn at PPV. Three-way with Owen? Question mark. 
it gives Kurt inherent build for why he's upset. Yeah. Um. Other than that, I think we're pretty good to book on the fly for things. We got a lot of new stuff starting. Uh, oh, 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 uh, promo for Funaki give give uh, Canyon another shot at PPP. Maybe a contract signing even. You just start with a contract signing. You're like, no, 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 come out here. This is a contract for a title shot. Your last title shot. Yeah. You impressed me, but uh, I'm not. I'm I will give you another shot if you agree that it's the last one. Canyon Desperate accepts it, and that's when he loses again. And, uh, or wins. Maybe we put him on a losing streak. Ooh. Maybe he's just sad, and that's when he goes away. We repack it. You want him? You want him, Mortis? I want the Mortis. Look, Canyon wasn't over. No. Bless him, but he was ten thousand times more interesting behind a mask. Period. Fair enough. All right. Uh, yeah, that'll be next time. Thanks for being here. We didn't plug anything at the beginning of the show, did we? No, we went immediately into wrestling. Yeah, Let's we really love wrestling. Now. Uh, buy my books. I got a new one. Sub to my Patreon, and you can be cool like Rob and a guy from Ohio. Um, it only costs a dollar at least, or five at, like, is nice. Um, like the video, comment on the video, both helps. Uh, that's about it. Watch wrestling.